This one's easier than it seems. It's the math guy, see. Evaluate the integral of 2x plus 3 over x squared minus 4 dx. This one we can split up since there's two terms in the numerator. So we can split this up into the integral of 2x over x squared minus 4 dx plus the integral of 3 over x squared minus 4 dx. Now we can evaluate these integrals separately. So this one here, to evaluate, we can use a u sub. I let u equal x squared minus 4. Then du is just 2x dx exactly what we have. And so this becomes the integral of one over u du, which of course is the ln of the absolute value of u. And this one here is a trig sub, right? Let x equal two secants of theta, then dx two secant of theta tangent of theta d theta. And of course, x squared minus four then becomes two secant of theta squared minus four. In other words, four secant squared of theta minus four. We get four times. Remember, secant squared minus one is tangent squared of theta. Plugging those in, this becomes three times the integral of two secant of theta tangent of theta d theta, or tan squared of theta. Well, then a tangent of theta cancels. Three halves times the integral of one over cosine of theta, and then divided by sine over cosine, we're multiplying by cosine of theta over sine of theta d theta. Well, now the cosines cancel. And so this just gives us three halves times the integral of cosecant, which is ln of absolute value of cosecant of theta minus cotangent of theta plus c. So our original substitution was that x equals two secant of theta. If we draw a triangle here, x over two is the secant. And this becomes the square root of x squared minus four. The cosecant would be x over the square root of x squared minus four minus, and the cotangent would be two over the square root of x squared minus four. This is the ln of absolute value of x minus two over the square root of x squared minus four plus c. This equals the ln of the absolute value of x squared minus four, ln of x minus two over the square root of x squared minus four. Don't forget your plus C. Always remember, math is everywhere.